Well, um, I am Gregory Harden. I am running for state representative in District 26. Um, I haven't lived as long as a life as these two, so I don't have as much to say about my um, uh, you know, 24 years of existence. <laughs> but um, I've lived here in Shawnee my entire life uh, with my dad. I got yeah, I share a name with him, as well as a house, I guess. <laughs> um, but, um, and, uh, yeah, uh, part of the reason why I'm running is because of hardworking people like my dad. Um, you know, he's been working his entire life, uh, works 12 hours a day, seven days a week, in order to make sure me and my family were able to know, eat and be able to go to school and, um, you know, and go to college and eventually start a YouTube show that I didn't think I was going to start and, you know, and now run for a seat that I wasn't planning on running for as early as I am, but I figured now would be a good time because the current person that's there is not really great for the people here in the district. Uh, um, I've already told my story about my big interaction with him, but uh, there's new people here who weren't there the first time when I told it, so I'll tell it. Um, this was 2018, it's like June of 2018, and the medical marijuana uh, question was on the ballot the same time you were on yep. the ballot. Yep. Um, and I saw him at Starbucks, and uh, I don't eat the food there. I just use their Wi-Fi. Um, <laughs> so I need to clarify that. Um, but, um, and I saw him come in. He eats the food there. So, yeah. Um, and um, uh, I asked him a question about what his stance was on the ballot question. And he turned to me and he said, um, he said he didn't like the way that I talk about him on social media. And that it uh, messes with his ability to be able to talk to me about things that happen at the Capitol and that he would like for me to not criticize him on social media. And so I was like, well, okay. And then he went on to not answer my question. Um, but that first part of it stuck with me because it was like, we weren't friends on Facebook at the time, still aren't. And so, you know, I had to go through my friends list and see who possibly might be spying on me. And, Drop a few people. Eventually, figured out who might be the spy. Um, but either way, um, that's the kind of response a lot of people have gotten from him when they ask him about his stances on things. Even a state representative that I know texted him about it privately, and he wouldn't even give a response on what his stance was. So he's not willing to even take a bad stance, which he passed here. Um, He's not willing to actually talk to people about what he's willing to do up there. And he's not willing to talk to people about what is going on up there. Um, so that's another part of the reason why I'm running. Um, let's see. Um, oh yeah, so it's a fundraiser. Um, money. Um, <laughs> um, I've had an okay time with fundraising so far up until recently because it's kind of an issue of needing more money so I can actually win the seat. Uh, the seat's winnable. Um, people have come close in the past. 2016, the Democrat came close 45%. And the Democrat in 2018 uh, got 43%. And um, I'm hoping to do better than them. I think I can do better than them. I'm gonna need money to be able to do that. I need money to pay my intern. Yay, Sierra! Sierra. Um, and um, so she can be able to knock doors, and I can be able to knock doors and have more material to be able to knock doors with. And, um, and yeah, um, I'm hoping, this is a big number, but I'm hoping to be able to get 24000 by the end of the summer. Um, that should be enough for me to be able to get more material to knock doors with. with Sierra. Um, and do probably put out mailers in September or August. Um, so, uh, yeah. Uh, let's see what other things I Yeah, that's 
pretty much it. Um, if it, you guys have any questions for me about anything, um, I'm here. You guys can take my card, my sign in. Make sure you guys sign in so I can fuck you for money later on <laughs> by email and text. Um, and, uh, what else? That's pretty much it. And also, make sure you guys contribute in some way to Lauren and for it in this campaign because, uh, I mean, I wouldn't be supporting Alan anyway because uh, he's not very great, but he also called me a pedophile online, so <laughs> kind of got to make sure the person who did that doesn't win anything. Yeah. So. Did he do it on the Republican Yes. Thing? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm the latest, too. Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. yeah. I'm not a pedophile. Oh, oh. This, but. Yeah, just a social social <laughs> communist. Oh. But I'm a social <laughs> communist. Me and Justin and Trudeau are the Just like that. Justin yeah. Trudeau. Yeah. 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 So weird. Uh, getting so compared weird. to Justin Trudeau is something. Yeah. It's like random. Kind of, kind of flattery in a way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was about to say, I was like, oh, I'm not pretty that young big. and yeah. dad looking and. Yeah. Yeah. Not like huge on Trudeau, but yeah. You know, <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. There are worse people to be compared to. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like yeah. Boris Johnson. Yeah. Like, yeah. Have you heard about that? Yeah. But anyway, you thank you everyone for coming. Yeah. Um, thank all of my family members for coming. Uh, all, all out in the audience. Um, <laughs> and um, the person I went to high school with, Jacob. How have you been? Well, good. I haven't seen you in like at least two or three years. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. I'm very jealous. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, everyone.